how your studies are going on i hope you all are doing well so i am kasis khan studying in 8th standard and today once again i am back with another crash course video and that is of course that is from class 10th mathematics and crt chapter number 1st that is real number exercise 1.1 question number 4 okay so let us move to question so for question number 4th is use euclid division lemma okay to show that the square of any positive integer is either of the form 3m or 3m plus 1 for some integer m so what does it mean euclid division lemma a equals to bq plus r where a is our dividend b is our divisor okay and q quotient plus r remainder okay so now let us move to solution so we can write that by euclid by euclid lemma where where a equals to bq plus r okay so a what is our a let a be any positive positive integer where b equals to 3 our b is 3 and q is some some integer some integer and possible value of r possible value of r equals to 0 1 and 2 okay so now we came on main point okay so now let us move to main point so we can write that a equals to what what is our b value b value is 3 so we can write 3 q okay our value is 0 okay so now in question also it is given that we have to square both side here also and here also so what we can write a square equals to 3 q square so a square equals to 9 q square now what we have to do what we have to do that we have to find such number that 9 will be completely divided so that is 3 3 q square now we will change this q square as m so we can write 3 m where m value is 3 q square now let us move to a equals to 3q plus 1 so both sided is square so a square equals to 3q plus 1 is square so now you will be noticing that here 3q plus 1 whole square okay means we have already read it read about it in class in class 7th okay uh, about 1 plus a plus b whole square that is a square plus 2ab plus b square okay so in maths each point is connected okay and each class is connected so we can write that 3q square plus 2 into 3q into 1 plus 1 is square okay now 3 3 is a 9q square plus 3 into 6 6q plus 1 now we'll find such number that 6 and 9 will be completely divided then that number is 3 so 3q square Plus two six q and this one in last we can write. Now this three q will be changed as m. So we can write three m plus one. Okay. Now let us move to three a equals to three m plus two. Okay. So we can write a square equals to three m plus two whole. Sorry, here we'll write q. Q. Okay. Whole square done. Now a square equals to three q square plus two into three q into two plus two square done. Now a square equals to three three is a nine q square plus three into two into two that is twelve q plus four. Okay. So now to this four nine uh, q square again we'll write as it is twelve q. Now to this four we can also write three plus one. Okay, we'll break it. 
now we'll find such number that 9 12 and 3 will can be exactly divisible that is 3 so 3 q square plus 4 q plus 1 and in last plus 1 okay now a square equals 2 we can write that this q will be changed as m this 1 plus 1 and plus 1 equals 2 plus 2 so now 3m plus 2 so now our question number fourth is finally solved now see you in my next video thank you very much